Tesla says it is adding radar in its cars next month amid self-driving suit concerns. Tesla told the FCC that it plans to market a new radar starting next month. The move raises even more concerns about potentially needed updates to its hardware suite to achieve the promised self-driving capability. Since 2016, Tesla has claimed that all its vehicles produced going forward have all the needed hardware to become self-driving with future software updates. It turned out not to be true. Why? I'm going to tell you now. Tesla already had to upgrade its onboard computer and cameras in earlier vehicles and it has yet to achieve self-driving capability, explains Electric in the report to which I'm re referencing now. Its full self-driving software is still in beta and doesn't enable fully autonomous driving. I understand it's difficult to achieve and it may take longer time. The car maker not only had to upgrade its hardware in some cases, but it even removed some hardware. First, it was the front-facing radar and more recently, the ultrasonic sensors. It sold part of its Tesla Vision approach where the automaker believes that the best way to achieve self-driving capability is through cameras being the only sensors. The logic is that the roads are designed to be operated by humans who operate cars through vision eyes and biological neural nets, brain. Tesla believes that the best way to replicate that is through cameras to replace the eyes and neural nets running on a computer to replace the brain. The company removed the radars on its vehicles last year. If you remember, we have reported it at this Talk News channel and um, last year and the ultrasonic sensor removed this year. Tesla did that. That's why it was surprising earlier this year when we learned and reported on Tesla filing with the FCC to use a new radar in its vehicles. The FCC had granted a confidential treatment to Tesla in order not to release the details of the new radar. Those confidential treatments are generally good for six months and it was coming up tomorrow. But here's what happened. Tesla has filed an extension. Here's what I learned from a tweet, Tesla is requesting short-term confidentiality extension in HD radar documents as it will be marketed mid-January. Any hints about the scene in code? Have you guys seen this in code? I have not. So as you just heard me in request, Tesla confirms that it plans to start marketing the new device in mid-January. I will have the reference in the description of this video so guys you can see it. It looks like what Elon Musk told Electric last year might be happening and Tesla is getting ready to put a more advanced radar inside its vehicles and potentially a whole new sensor suite based on the Model 3 prototype. There is also the possibility that Tesla is referring to an in-cabin in -cabin radar which the company has introduced in the Model S before. But considering that the application is taking is actually talking about the HDAR radar, it seems more likely that it is for driver assist features. Friends, Tesla was always going to keep improving its autopilot self-driving hardware, so there is nothing wrong with what's happening right now. But it still fits into the growing concerns that Tesla cannot achieve its promised self-driving capability within the current hardware hardware. It looks like Tesla needs to change the hardware. And I understand this because Tesla engineers probably didn't know about this in the beginning. So as we learn, time goes on, we learn more. So there is a possibility that Tesla is going to unveil a new suite of self-driving hardware next month that just improves the capability and Tesla still plans to deliver self-driving on the current hardware. But Electric thinks that there is room for concerns after Tesla has been wrong about self-driving several times already. It might be wrong about the current vehicles being able to achieve it. What do you think? Do you think Tesla can achieve this with current uh, vehicles or needs a new hardware to achieve full self-driving? I don't know. In any case, I enjoy my driving and I'm happy with that. 
God bless you everyone. Peace be with all of you. If you found this information interesting, please subscribe and give us thumbs up. I'll see you soon in our next Tesla report.